okay starting with practice exercise 2 if the perimeter of a rectangle is p and its diagonal is d then the difference between the length and width of the rectangle is okay we can solve this as we have given 2l plus 2b is equal to p and l square plus b square equal to p square uh, equal to d square and then the difference between the length and width of the rectangle so we can see l minus or l minus b ka whole square is l square plus b square minus 2lb or if we square both side of this equation i'll be getting 4l square plus 4b square plus 8lb is equal to p square so that is 4 into l square plus b square will give me 4d square plus 8lb is equal to p square or i can say lb from here will be p square minus 4d square by 8 i can put the values of this lb here and say l square plus b square is d square minus 2 into p square minus 4d square by 8 and that square root of that will give me l minus p 2 into 4 so i can say here okay, l minus p is equal to 4d square minus p square plus 4d square by 4 under root so which is 8d square minus p square by 4 under root so option d would be my correct answer but you can actually solve this question by putting some values let's consider that the length length of a rectangle is 3 width is 4 or vice versa then the diagonal is going to be 5 i know that pythagorean triplet 3 4 5 i can, and i can now check the answer because the difference between and length and width in this case should be 1 the perimeter in this case will become 3 plus 4 7 into 2 14 So put P is fourteen, D is five. The answer must be one. If I check here, if it is five square, five square twenty five into eight, two hundred, two hundred minus fourteen square, two hundred minus fourteen square will be four. So four by two root. so this is not one now if i know 8d square minus p square is 4 so 4 by 4 is going to be 1 right so you can actually adopt such kind of method where you can put values and check the answer